got rich problems. I got rich problems. And homie, but some boss talk. It's hot there. I can get my. Yo, 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 we back, man. What's going on, we man? Back. Hey, man, we got, hey, I guess I'm going to talk a little bit. <laughs> How you doing? I'm good. How y'all doing today? Man, Brittany Loso, man. So what she's doing is she's taking over, man. She's doing rich people problems for Boss Talk 101, man. You we know. just, we loving her presence, man. Her energy, man. We got, hey, we feel mm. like we scaling right now, man. So what's going on? You know, I had to come in, you know, <laughs> the Boss Talk family. Hey. I've been going to and fro. I've been going high and low, you know. I always got to come back home. So, you know, I'm here Already. to bring y'all some problems that the rich folks is having today. Whoa, wow. man. Okay. Wow. They're always having problems. These are some problems I look forward to. I look forward, like, you know, these are the problems that we don't have yet, <laughs> but uh, we want to embrace hey. when they come. When they man. come. When they come. So, for the for the first topic we're going to go into for rich people problems. Okay. 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 It's gonna be fifty cent son. Man, hmm. I seen that boy. That boy, hey, that's the same one that was on that. Oh, he was on that. Uh, uh, boy, I told you don't play with them wanksters. Hmm. What you doing? Nothing. What's up? Did I tell you not to play with these wanksters? Okay, that's that. Hmm. On, the, on the video, he was a little kid. Man, so basically, Marquise, he is saying that the money he was given was not enough for him to survive. And he took a picture and everything, and basically, you know, 50 was like, yo, you entitled. And he's like, entitled? 6,200? I know what it feels like to have nothing, all right? And I had to rebuild my life over with 6,700 a month. That's how much it was? 6,200. Ooh. Man. Wow. Rich people problem. But then 6,200 a month. For, See, my uh, daddy didn't give me 6,200 for the year. Uh, so, uh, 6,200 6, a month is not enough. Wow. Man, let me tell you something. But then I saw an article the other day that said that he had said um, he was going to pay his daddy. What is it, 70? 60, no, 6,200. Was that 6,200? He, he said, said he's going to pay his daddy yeah, just to be his father or something like that? For a day. Yeah. Do all that. That was the, yeah. That's But he, he has his father's pettiness. Mm, the man. father's petty is there. Mm, mm, it's in the blood. And you, you, you know, he looks so much like him. I was about, just it's, about to say. And that's what makes it bad. It's like 50 verse 50. I'm here for it. I'm here for it. <laughs> man, his dad is incredible, man. Just the way that he basically has. Uh, we watching the hell out of uh, Raising Canaan and all oh, Man. <laughs> and I, I get a vitamin water shows. probably like twice a week. Uh -huh. So he, you know, he made that money from that that deal too. Yep. So I'm just trying to figure out, man. Like, like if I was his son, yeah, I'd be trying to get one of the movies, man. Let me get son? this check, man. No, no, no. I, I guess I'm just different. If I'm his son, I'm gonna prove to him that you know what, I don't need you. I'm gonna be bigger than you. I'm gonna go out there and grind and hustle and show you That's that right. I can do it on my own. That's, That's right. What he want. This is a bad case of Simba versus love. Mufasa. This is a bad case of son against. Yeah, you know we just gonna have to watch it play out. But you know, Fifty don't have no hold on that petty. Man. But also this week, okay. So last week, okay. Have y'all had y'all low vibration place yet? Mm -hmm. Okay, so basically Coast Storm and we some may know, some may not. <laughs> Coast Storm is basically eating her food and she is pointing to her friend who she's obviously a mentor of, hopefully uh, given the energy, and let her know she was eating a low vibration plate. They put this on my plate. I will not let no I don't do what they do, I do what I do. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be I'm gonna leave. But she's I will never eat a plate that looks like this. Mm -hmm. Pay me a million dollars to do that to my son. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. And it can serve better than that. It's mm. low vibration. Low you gotta vibration. I heard play. about that. Yes. Because they said energy and everything comes from your food. Because everything you put in your body, it feeds, you know, it feeds yes. your soul and stuff See, like I that. I understood that part. Right. If the only thing was the place looked like they was made at the same line. <laughs> and uh, it was just, I don't know gimmick. if she was under the, gimmick. I don't know if she was under the influence. Because, you know, when you're under the influence, yeah, yeah, we yeah, can yeah, see yeah, yeah. things a lot different than a person who not. Yeah. And so she was just pointing out how her play looked like she was a hood rat and hers reflected she was royalty. And huh. if they were to ask who is a hood rat and who's royalty, they'll point to her plate. Just so, by the plate. Oh, Without man. even looking at the person. Nah, just just by looking the at the plate. That's man. some rich people problems mm -hmm. you can definitely yeah, have. Yeah, yeah. I don't know nothing about that plate, but I'm going to learn all about the plate. <laughs> Well, we're going to have to put in prayer. I want to play for, you know, next we're going to have Mr. Charleston. Oh, man. 
Mr. Charleston mm. is dabbling. Now, I don't know if he's a rich person, but you know, he can be rich. <laughs> he is rich in his stance and where he stands when it comes to the, the these internet. rappers. He don't social like media. Social media. So these rappers, he is rich in that, okay? Mm -hmm. He is having a problem right now with T.I. But look how your son look, talking about he'll jump on a 50-something-year-old. Yo, boy, hey, you, you, so T.I., them the kind of boys you got. Say, T.I., listen, if your boy jump on me, y'all will bury that yellow I sh right in his goddamn throat. Yeah, I I seen a little bit of that. You know, Charleston, man, he saw, man, he been on here a few times, and that was a long time ago. But mm. at the end of the day, uh, yeah, he's uh, he's different. Yeah. But he didn't start Is out with T.I. He started having a problem with the son, and that's uh -huh. when T.I. jumped in oh. as Papa Bear should and be like, uh-uh, you can't be talking about my son or messing with my son. If you have a yeah. problem with my son, you come to me. I put my foot so far up your She'll floss your teeth with my shoelaces. You don't want to play with me, bro. Don't play with me, bro. Don't play with mine, bro. Don't play with mine. Just don't play with mine. I ain't finna say no name, cause I don't play police games. If I go to jail, it's gonna be for something. It's gonna be for something. I don't play no police game, man. I don't play no police game. I don't play no internet game. I don't do none of that, bro. Bro. Just know as you move around, man. Man, your life is real, bro. It ain't no mother. Joke? Ain't no motherfucking game. They look about the same size and weight and size. I, I kind of look can at them Can they do like head to head? Like you think they can? Like if you gonna come see Paul? You gotta you know put them paws on them. So I mean, are they gonna? You know these are rich people problems. They don't handle it like we would. They have a different way of handling it. You know, like I kind of like the boosted stance on it, where you just kind of stay back and you don't exactly. speak on it. Um, I'm I, being that I've been a victim. And Boosie's son, I, I've seen this situation before, up yeah. close and personal. So at the end of the day, I know that basically, you know, if you already know, you ain't really got to speak on it. Right. And if you're not, I mean, I don't like the internet going back and forth. I don't like messing with nobody that's gonna call the police. Okay, <laughs> me personally, look, if he already is a nine one, if his fingers are already ready already to die, I'm police. okay on it. I'm gonna let it go, <laughs> man. Because because it's just it's just getting out of hand. You start with the sun, no limits on that, and then you go into pop. But he's been doing this for a long time. If it's not Ti, it's you know he started out with Kevin Gates doing that, and it, until they you know they squashed right. that. But everybody who's seen him online know what he does. And he's and so with that being said, is that comedy? Is that I, is that we? It's a thin line between you know it, funny. And disrespectful. But then, but then, when you talk about comedy, a lot of people say that's not comedy. But then, at the same time, when you had Chris Rock said something and Will Smith went up there and slapped him, yeah, well, I'll, because he didn't think it was funny. Uh, uh, it was it wasn't funny. You it see was, what I mean? Yeah. But, but Chris, to Chris Rock, oh, it's it's comedy. I think uh, I'm a little different, man. I, like I said, I feel like uh, it, when it come down to children. I understood what T.I. was saying. Mm -hmm. T.I. had something to say about it. He was like, man, this guy, you older and this is a kid. Why would you even be going at a kid? Mm -hmm. And and that that's the part where, I mean, when you start talking about the kids and the children on, on, in a disrespectful way, that's kind of, that's that's a hard that's a hard one for me. That is I never, sometimes. I never be able to, I, I, that's not, I, I mean, I, I we actually brought kids here and put like clothes on kids back right. here at this store, mm -hmm. me and Charleston. So, yeah. um, and it gets conflicting when when you talk about them and go at them in a way to where it's a, a f you bit, you know, using those four letter words and stuff. It's just, and I know mama and and hard failed kids were, were know, raised like that a right. lot of times, but that's from their parent though. That's true, but I'm gonna just let y'all know, Brittany Loso, if we into it, ain't nothing off limits. So please consider everything yeah. that the you kids have. And everything. Yeah, so you before I get talk about I them know kids I too. done try to talk. I know I'm, I'm talk. I could talk it through. I know. I'm gonna give you a chance. I know I'm gonna give you probably another chance, but after that, going in. listen. Just know that you taking everything in consideration for you coming this way. I ain't got no st look. Is that where we're going to take it? That's what we're going to take Man, it. Man, you know, I just, I like I said, I think that with the way the internet is today, mm -hmm. you got Takashi 6 9 he did his thing. Where made he millions. Going, made, and still millions. got millions uh -huh. behind it. You got uh, different people in different eras that was clowned. You had the Welvin, and you had all these different people who was benefiting off the internet. Mm -hmm. And so I think a lot of times when you see different 
people start to do all of these different things and 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 go at different people in different ways and on both sides i think it's beneficial Ooh. it's beneficial from both sides because even if you got millions and you can spark up a flame that's millions more that you making when you in the, it don't matter if you work for 100 million 50 million when your name rise to the top on that internet it's mm-hmm. beneficial as hell for you. So but you just never know what's real out here. But yeah. at, you know at, the same, at the same time, though, they say this internet stuff as is a game. But words do hurt. Some people don't just brush off words. Some people take words as a weapon. Mm-hmm. Right. But the thing is that, like, it shows me, like, how far will anybody take it just to be popular, just to have their name right. up here? Like, what will you not do? Where are your moral standings? You know, mm-hmm. do you have any? Right. And, you know, I don't think you have much, but, you know, at the end of the day, it's a rich person problem. How they going to handle it? We would squabble down the street if that's how we really feeling. When you worth a couple of M's up. <laughs> uh, yeah, they really no who want to mess up your ears? I mean, who, who mess, like, who would really mess with T.I.? Like, the man was caught with a hundred guns. Whoa. You know what, what I'm saying? <laughs> I remember that. In Actually, real life, I was though. around him uh, when he, before he left like, and when he came like back. Like, real life. Like, yeah. who uh, You know, don't poke the bears that you know can't bite you. I don't like that part. It's like, it's like, it's like poking the bear that's in the cage. Mm -hmm. You know, the bear can't come back to you. If don't do nothing to the bear, the bear wasn't right there. Don't do nothing you wouldn't do. If the bear was was right right there in front of you. Exactly. And so for the most of us, we ain't gonna have that problem. Hopefully, one day. <laughs> I hope so. Well, man, I enjoyed that, man. Thank you so much, Already. man. Already, and this your girl, Brittany Loso, with Rich People Problems. Man. So, you already know, Boss Talk 101. I got rich problems. I got rich problems.